Hello viewers, in today's show, I will be delving into the world of fashion, African fashion. of nature's show i have a very special guest who is into african fashion she makes exquisite designs with african prints I introduce herself to you. Introduce yourself to my audience, please. My name is Mrs. Mabel Danso and Kansa and Somatia. I am the owner of Mabel Fashion in Charlton, London, United Kingdom. Welcome to the show, Miss Mabel. It's nice to have you on World of Nature's show. Thank you very much. Uh, how long have you been in this fashion business? 30 years. Oh, that's a very long time. What prompted your love for this African fashion design? I mean, my mom was a fashion designer in Ghana. So you're a Ghanaian, I see. Yes, of course, I am Ghanaian. So where did you start? I started in Ghana. Miss Mabel, who are your customers? My customers are mainly Africans. What, where do they wear these African outfits to? Do they wear them to the offices or to occasions? Wedding, churches, engagement, and funeral. Oh, you, you saw occasional African wear? Yes, of course. Besides Africans, do you have other ethnicities that um, that you provide services to? Yes. Who are they? English, Indians. So you have English and Indians? Yes. Interesting. Megal, can you tell myself and my viewers, what are your busy times in this line of business? My busy time is summer. Why summer? My customers have parties, wedding to attend, oh. a lot of activities. Activities, oh yeah, because summertime is when we are all out and about. And of course, African prints are very light. Obviously, you can wear African prints in summer and um, be very comfortable with them. I can't see us wearing African prints in winter time, can we? No. no. <laughs> okay. So. Is it important to have a shop front? Must you have a shop like you have right now for a business like yours? Yes, it's important to have a shop front for this type of business. How do your customers come to you? Yeah, my customers come to me word of mouth. Any other way except word of mouth? Do you advertise on the social media platform? Yes, yeah, some people go to my Instagram. I get customers from Instagram also. I'm going to be leaving uh, Mabel Fashion contact details, her social media uh, details in the show note. Because every business has challenges. What are your challenges in this business? Short notices from my lawyer customers because I can't say no. Mabel, what advice do you have for anybody who wants to come into this African design business? They have to be patient. Sometimes you have rude customers if you don't have patience you can't do this job and my second advice they have to know about fabrics is it necessary to have a university degree to start this business if you don't have the finances it's not compulsory to have a, a university degree well, i have often asked most business owners on this show if their businesses can make them millionaires so tell us tell my viewers middle can you be a millionaire in this business yes of course how can you be a millionaire in this business of african prints you can establish school and teach african designs it's got a lot of potential viewers did you hear that you can actually be a millionaire in african designs 
if of course you can establish like an academy where you can teach African designs. To get into this business is pretty easy. You can start by being an apprentice in an African design shop. You also need to know about fabrics so that you can help the customers in knowing and choosing what fabrics and what what designs go with a certain fabric. Thank you very much Lady Juliet for having me on your show. Well you're welcome. Thank you so much. Absolute pleasure to have you on okay. World of Nature's show. Viewers, thank you very much for sticking with me on this show. Uh, I hope to come your way again soon, I hope, with another interesting business note. Remember, live and living is not cheap. Stay on the hustle. Bye for now. <laughs>